I am Nand Kishore, Professor in Department of Chemistry of Indian Institute of Technology, Bombay. And this course on chemical and biological thermodynamics is intended to cover contents right from principles to applications and is expected to benefit the audience from academics to industry. As I just mentioned, this course will be beneficial for students of chemistry, chemical engineering, biosciences, biotechnology and pharmaceutical sciences. It will help to learn basic concepts of chemical thermodynamics to applications which are not only important in academics, but also in chemical and pharmaceutical industries including protein folding, stability and recognition. Chemical thermodynamics, the principles of chemical thermodynamics and various thermodynamic quantities have tremendous applications right from basic sciences to technological applications. Therefore, the contents of the course have been accordingly designed. We will begin from the definitions of system surrounding state functions, path functions, standard state and then take the course through discussion on various thermodynamic quantities such as enthalpy, internal energy, Gibbs energy, entropy, Helmholtz free energy, chemical potential, heat, work, concepts to applications. We will cover laws of thermodynamics, relevance of reversibility, entropy and its applications, adiabatic demagnetization and the applications of Maxwell relations. Another important topic activity and activity coefficient and its relevance to ideal and non-ideal systems will be discussed and also the course will cover a very important component on equilibrium to equilibrium constant starting from concepts to applications. In each case, we will also take sufficient tutorial problems so that the concepts become more clearer. After discussing the basic principles, we will further discuss the applications of the thermodynamics and we will cover the type of systems to technology development. Specifically, we will focus on differential scanning calorimetry, isothermal titration calorimetry, principles to applications in protein folding, chemical and pharmaceutical industries. And simultaneously, we will also cover the tutorial problems which have relevance to chemical and pharmaceutical industries. And also, we will extend our discussion to thermodynamics in rational drug design. The outcome of the course will be in terms of academic enrichment on chemical and biological thermodynamics and it is expected to be beneficial for chemical and pharmaceutical industries also. The recommended books for this course include Physical Chemistry by P. W. Atkins and J. D. Paola, Physical Chemistry by R. J. Selby and Robert A. Alberti, Biocalorimetry, Applications of Calorimetry in Biological Sciences by John E. Ledbury and Biothermodynamics the role of thermodynamics in biochemical engineering and the different editions of these books are available An appropriate edition can be consulted for this course. So, I hope that the students of chemistry, biology, biochemistry, pharmaceutical sciences, chemical engineering and many other disciplines will get benefited from this course. And Help, this course will help in understanding connecting the fundamental principles to applications. Thank you very much.